this is Spy Gaming, and today I'll be showing a tutorial on how to add an overlay for like an outro, per se, to a video. So today I'll be doing my outro, and why I'm doing this is because I was looking up how to do it originally, and I could not find anything. So I had to kind of figure out myself with a lot of trial and error, yada yada yada. So I was just going to make a tutorial to help everyone. So you go up, and you, of course you add your clips to your media pool and everything, so you got outro, and let's just put in my tro video, not that video. That's a mess up from earlier. Okay, so, and you want to go down edit, you put your that on the middle layer, and you add the second video on the top like that. Okay, so it's very long, you zoom out with this thing. And you come over here to the two things like that, and you drag it all the way down to there. You click to confirm that. Zoom in all the way over, and then boom. So let's zoom in a little more. Okay. So now you click on this top video. You see how these two are connected with the orange? You come over to this little link, click it, and then should yep. And then you come here. And you say delete on your keyboard. So now, if you, usually that is off. Click that button on this little screen. Pull up on one of these corners and start start the video. And then stop it here. And see now it's like this. And it has the whatever it's called uh, the intro or the outro. Sorry. Just try to get it to fit into the square. It doesn't have to be perfect. You can stretch it a little bit. Try to make it look good. So like that, and you click down here. So now, start the right or the read head thing. You play it, but this is still here, and it's kind of out of place. So I'll fix that. So stop it. Make it go back just so I can find the area. Stop it again. Click that. Edit it just so it's down. Take it back like that. And play. And done. So stop it. Okay. So to do this, to fix it, so let's bring it back to the beginning. You come over here to where it makes that little head. And you just cut till it about lines up. And then play. So hopefully, oh, so I made it too short. So now, since I didn't cut on this side, oh, did it freeze? Oh, yes. Okay. So this side, stop playing. So I didn't cut on this side. I can drag it over because it's gonna have to be the same on this side. So play. Uh, stop. Sorry. So play it from the beginning. I'm so sorry if this it's kind of laggy. Scrubbing through footage uses a lot of CPU and everything, and so yeah, and recording also takes a lot of CPU. So it's still popping up, not at the right time. Let's try that. Too early. So forward a little bit. Wait for it to catch up. Nope. Nope. So play. Too early. So pause. Forward a little bit. Bring the read head over. Play it. Nope. Pause. Over. Try that. Ooh, it's close. Is that too early or too late? Get back. Play. Come on. There you go. Too little bit too late, so we try it just a hair over. See if that fixes it. So play. So that's pretty much good. So on the end, end now, try to get it to match. So, right. most, this is really bad when most of this is loading time. That's great. So about there. Let's see if that's it. And give me just a little bit, just in case. 
right there. Perfect. So now, I'm going to take it, and this is probably messed up just a little bit, so you want to, I usually do a, just a video transition. You drag it over, put it there. So now, if you play this, and done. Usually it does it very well, sometimes it doesn't, but that's everything. You just gotta play with it, with these and everything, and you go deliver, and you do all your stuff, and you add to render queue and start the render. This will take a few seconds.